The thing that makes us human isn't just biology. Humans are animals. In fact, we are just another ape, but what sets us apart is our advanced cognitive abilities, complex language, and culture. Many animals display empathy, cooperation, and even a sense of fairness. Some species have sophisticated communication, tool use, and social bonds that mirror aspects of human life. Yet, at some point in evolution, we believe we became human. What was our first culture? What was the behavior that began to define us as human? Science does not tell us what it is to be human. That is mostly a philosophical question. At one time, we were human because we were God's chosen species. So what human is, is mostly up to culture to decide for itself. Science also doesn't really tell us exactly when we became human. However, science does offer us a story of how we became human. It offers us a story called evolution that can be seen as the ultimate chronotrope of the road, where according to the Russian literary theorist Mikhail Bakhtin, representatives of all social classes, estates, religions, nationalities, ages, intersect at one spatial and temporal point. Thus, the story of evolution, like Bakhtin's chronotrope of the road, is a particularly good place for random encounters. One can imagine many random encounters for our pre-human ape ancestors, but is there a random encounter that changed the very nature of who we would become? For a story is not just a series of random encounters, but also, the story is the reactions and effects displayed by the protagonist in relation to the random encounters.